millions of people are watching these pictures in well over 100 countries. To Joe Veglos, hoping to win some silverware in his first season with Celtic. The Capacan over there already has some silverware in his first season with the Rangers. There are 52,000 inside Hampton Park. They're about to make you feel like you're here. Listen out for the new Hampton roar as the two teams enter this spectacular arena. Yeah, Jonathan Gould not happy at the, the players on the wall here. He did it well, Amaru, so just dragged it slightly wide of the target. But Jonathan Gould not happy with the defenders in front of him. Amaruso made his Rangers debut against Celtic in the Scottish Cup. Ravchik sneaking it through to Larson. He tries to turn Hendry, oh, that bounced off Albets, back into the box. And then Lambert had a go! Oh, what a wonderful effort! And Paul Lambert. Yeah, it certainly was, it just sat up for him. And he hit it early, it was dipping and moving. It just didn't quite come down far enough for him. I don't think Stefan Kloss knew much about this, his former Dortmund teammate, of course. Well saved by the crossbar, that's a fine effort, a fine strike from Paul Lambert. And it just wouldn't come down early enough for him. Lambert to Blinker. McKinnis snapped in, and what Wallace might just get to this, you know. He has done! Wallace is in! Oh! And Jonathan Gould just managed to get his hands on it as Rod Wallace Lost control of it at a vital time. Yeah, Jonathan Gould did well. Rod Wallace just too quick here for Rico Anone. And so far, Wallace hasn't had a sniff, but he's away from him here. The control just lets him down at the vital moment there, but Jonathan Gould did well to make up his mind early. Come and close Wallace down there. That's a touch that let Wallace down. McCann has got away from Boyd here. McCann sends it in. And Amato nearly on the end of it, but fortunately for Celtic, Jonathan Gould was. That was a tempting ball in there by Neil McCann to the back post. And once again, Jonathan Gould does well to react quickly. Here's Larson, meantime, a horrible bouncing ball for Rangers. And Larson almost capitalised. That's the old firm game for you. It goes from one end to the other in no time. There's certainly no protest from Henrik Larsson here, some of the Celtic supporters claiming a penalty. Certainly wins the ball first. Klaus, I, I think it's a good glove in the ball there. Henrik Larsson himself was making no complaint at all. Vidmar. And here is Tony Vidmar, it opens up for him! Superb save from Jonathan Gould. And Rangers signal their intentions right at the start of the second half. Well, a super play from Vidmar, a good exchange here with Alberts to make the space, and he caught it well enough. That's a fine move like save again from Jonathan Gould. Mialbi, in step Donato for Rangers. Bronkos, Vidmar. It went away from Wallace, but it comes back to him! And Rangers are in front in the Scottish Cup final! And it's run, Wallace! Well, who else? The man who really has lit up Rangers season since he came north of the border. Once again, Vidmar was involved in the left-hand side here. 
behind Wallace there, it eventually breaks to him, sits up perfectly. Jonathan Gould exposed and left with absolutely no chance. Just sits up beautifully for him, and he was never going to miss from this range. Falls behind him there, gets a break of the ball off Neil McCann. And you can see the delight in Dick Advocat's face. Sensational to dispose of Mialbi. And now he finds Albert. Lambert's free kick aimed towards Stubbs. Blinker missed his kick. Mahi blocked by Amorusa. Another chance for Celtic. Blinker's cross. Stubbs didn't make much contact, but his big horse! Splendid save from Stefan Kloss. One of the best shot stoppers around. Albert. Celtic are giving it a go now. Boyd. Good mark took it away from him, but here's Lambert. back by Van Bronckhorst. What a good save it was from Stefan Kloss here. Martin Bukos spared at the back post as it breaks to him. It's time to take the touch, measure it. He got it well on target, a good save by Kloss. You can't really ask any more from Martin Bukos here than what he did. He got it well enough on target. Lambert now. Poor Stubbs. It comes back to him. Away by Hendry, and Mahi nearly was in for an equaliser. But it all came from Stubbs' willingness to, to step forward there. As the ball comes in, it falls perfectly for Mahi at the back post here. The header from Stubbs across the face of the goal, touch from Hendry. And just rolls straight to Stefan Kloss. Johnson, Henrik Larsson, straight across. Yeah, it was a decent chance as well. Just sits up nicely for Henrik Larsson here. And he hits it straight at Stefan Kloss. Quick free kick was taken. Even though the Celtic man is still down. And but here's uh, Alberts means up. Alberts breaking. And he sends it across for Gabriel Amato. And Jonathan Gould has kept Celtic's hopes alive. Well, that's a magnificent save from Jonathan Gould there with his left foot. Rangers had men over here as Alberts broke. It's time to look up, plays it in. Amato time to measure it. And that's a fabulous stop there from Jonathan Gould. Why Celtic were in a hurry to take the free kick when Paul Lambert was down injured, I really don't know. Big horse. All crosses flat a little. Stubbs is there. Lambert was that handball from Amoruso. Hugh Dallas has a look and says no. Well, I'd like to see this one again. Comes out here, it's Lambert with the outside of the right foot as it breaks here. Lambert to Mialbi. There's no time for anything fancy now. That's what you've got to do. Get it up there. Tommy Johnson. Away by Amoruso. Hugh Dallas has checked his watch. Here's Van Bronckhorst. It's all over. Last season they were left with nothing. This season they have everything. It's a tremendous trouble for Dick Advocat's new look Rangers team. And it really doesn't get much better than this. Rod Wallace, the match winner. At the start of the month, they clinch the title at Celtic Park. At the end of the month, they've seen off their oh-so-fierce rivals again to
because the 97-98 season wasn't too great. But 98-99 has been just fine. It's time for Rangers to bounce up these steps. Lorenzo Amoruso is about to show the watching world that Rangers have won the Scottish Cup and the treble.